Alright everybody, welcome back to the channel. My name's CJ, and I know it's been a while, but uh, we're going to try to make some videos here. we got some catching up to do. We've got a new product here that was sent from Postmart, which is short for Home Smart. It's a company that makes uh, different types of alarms. And what they sent me here, they saw uh, I have trouble with uh, trespassing every once in a while. So they sent me this eMacros wireless solar driveway alarm. And as you can see, it can reach up to a half mile away. And then here, right here is the motion sensor. One of them. Now see what's neat about this is here's the motion sensor in there and notice that it's solar powered which I always like that and here's the actual alarm take this out of the box here here's the actual alarm and as you can see you can hook up seven of these different sensors and they all will go back to this one alarm system, this hub. Okay, so there's two places that I want to put these things. I want to put one of them on the back side of my garage and I'm going to put this other one on the top side of the barn because both places I can't see and we can't get Wi-Fi out there to put cameras up so this should work to alarm me if anybody or anything's messing around with the doors on the garage and on the barn. But first, what I'm going to do is test these things out. So on the top here, take this little uh, rubber piece and we'll turn that on. There it's on. We'll do it with the other one. Turn it on. And then with this hub, I might have to plug this in. Yeah, I don't, this can take batteries or be plugged in. So let me go plug this in real quick. See, they're detecting motion. And they, they're shining the lights. Let's see which one is which here. I'm going to move this one. This is number two. And here's one. You can also control the volume on the side of how loud you want the alarm to be. So we're going to put number one on the back side of the garage and then we'll put number two up there by the barn. Okay, so the easiest way to install this is going to be to unscrew this here in the back and then get that all the way off and then just pull this off and then we can just screw this mounting bracket to the wall wherever you're going to mount it and then just stick this ball right back in there and then screw this back on. Now, I know this is going to sound dumb, but make sure that your solar panel is up on top. I know that sounds dumb, but I could see myself doing that. So like I said, in this garage I can't get Wi-Fi at all, even on the front. So here we are in the back. I have some equipment back here, and it'd be easy for someone to mess around with this door and try to break in, so I think this is a good spot to mount this first one. Solar panel up. Screw that on. Let's go to the one up at the barn. Alright, so here's another door that I can't see from the house. And it's too far away to get the Wi-Fi for a camera. So I'm going to put one up on top and have it aiming straight down. And no one will definitely be able to reach this one. <laughs> Snap her in. And screw this nut on. Man, it is another hot day out here. So I'm gonna get a hold of Kelsey. Hey. Yeah. Alright, go in the living room and turn that uh, box on. Okay. 
please. There's a power button on the side. Okay, here Nine. we go. Two? Is that two? Two, yeah. Let me do it again. Okay, you can turn that down on the side too. Oh, okay. There you go. All right. Okay. All right. I'll go get the other one. Okay, let's let's do number one. Okay. Okay, let me go back further here. Okay, it's not let's see how close. Okay, right up against the door. Okay, that'll work. Good. All right. Thank you. Yep. Perfect. Thank you. All right, so I'm right here beside the door, and it went off. I don't know how far these things reach, but uh, that's the main thing. I want it to detect if someone's messing around the door here. All right, so we got both of them installed. They're both working, and did you notice they both have different chimes? I could see using this for like if you have a long driveway put it at the end of your driveway that way you know someone's coming or there's something messing around up there yes I know the animals are going to set it off every once in a while but at least this makes you aware that there is something around your property or your buildings or I, I would even put one around a box blind or a tree stand if you had one within a half mile range if you're uh, wanting to buy one of these we have a uh, discount code mallard5 in all caps and that will give you a 10 percent discount and then that helps us out here with the channel too so i hope you like this video today this is a good product for trespassing you know uh, i have trouble with that every now and then people just don't respect property or boundaries or anything they think everything is theirs so this will help you defend your property and make you more aware of what's going on what's moving around I hope you like this video. Thank you for Hostmart for uh, sending this uh, solar-powered alarm system to us. And until next time, thanks for watching.